morning to you and Merry Christmas to you. In the Gospel of Thomas, Jesus said, Blessed is he who came into being before he came into being. The Christ was before Jesus came into being. You were before that body came into being. And now as that body, you are waking up to this Christ within you, to this love, this peace within you. Today, I want you to take this quote from Herb Fitch and make it your mantra. I am not man or woman. I live the day as I, spirit. I am not man or woman. I live the day as I, spirit. Say that to yourself with eyes open, aware of that body. I am not man or woman and feel that slight detachment from that body. I live the day as I, spirit. Say it again. I am not man or woman and feel the detachment. I live the day as I, spirit. I want you to repeat those words today as often as you can remember and then linger in that open spaciousness that follows the words, that follows the recognition that you're not present as that body. You are present, but you're this invisible Christ aware of the body, aware of the world, seeming to appear as them, watching, loving, the essence of this witnessing, this perception that comes from awareness aware of itself is love. Become aware of love now. Don't try. Love is what you are. Love is what your soul is made of. Love is what the Christ is. No matter how small a perception is, fill it. My daughter very easily fills it in her feet. Whenever she's nervous or worried about a test, I tell her to breathe her way down into her feet. And there it is. And from there, you can become aware of it in your legs and in your stomach and your chest and your head. And then you drop the concept of the body entirely and just stay there as the feeling, as the vibration, as this Christ appearing as the body. That body is infused now consciously with Christ's being. It smiles, it sits up taller, it shares, it gives, it listens, it loves. Because of this love that you are, because of your love, it loves. Today, we also celebrate the birth of your awareness of the Christ within you. The Christ has always been here. You've always been here. And now we celebrate because you see that, you're remembering that, because you feel that. St. Anthony of the Desert said, Every day I say to myself, Today I will begin. Every morning for Many years now, I woke up with that same intention. Today, I begin. Today, I am not man or woman. I live the day as I, spirit, as the Christ. Not good humanhood, not bad humanhood, Christhood. And all of those words to serve just the one purpose of stepping out, stepping back into the kingdom, into this invisible love, this invisible Christhood, and being that, what I already am, not becoming that, waking up in that position, remembering that I am that and that everyone else is that, even though they appear as bodies. There are no people that you'll come into contact with today. Those bodies that you call family and friends, appreciate them, love them by seeing through them, filling through them to the Christ that they are too. This one Christ we all are, seeing your family, seeing your friends, knowing the one, invisible one that is amongst you, in the midst of you, as you. 
If you're alone today, feeling the Christ, feeling yourself to be the Christ, and knowing that only the Christ is here, only love is here, only you are here. You pervade everywhere. You're not just there. You're here and everywhere in between. Appearing as your city, appearing as Assisi, Italy, appearing as Christmas Day. Later, you'll be appearing as New Year's Day. But it's the same one now presence, the same one being. Right now, we call it 2021. And in a later now, we'll call it 2022. But it's just the same one, the same one that was when Jesus walked this earth. The same one that was the day Jesus was born. The same Christ that was long before Abraham was. Long before the Buddha and Krishna was. This Christ is this love. This awareness is resting in that, sitting on that throne. I'm with you. I love you. Merry Christmas to you. And we'll chat tomorrow. If this episode helped you feel good, helped you feel God, then leave a review on Apple Podcasts and screenshot it and send it to me for a free gift. And follow me on Patreon so I can see you, so I can see your smile.